So there's no need to come and queue in a line for many hours, you know, it's inconvenient and in particular it is uh, inconvenient to those students and their parents. So what we've been doing since uh, the metric results uh, were released last week Thursday is to then start with our matching process and it's also an automatic process where we then compare the results of those um, applicants that have applied last year, by the end of September last year. Our advice then to applicants who are on waiting list who have been declined, but even to those that have been accepted for a program but now want to move to a different program, who may have applied for a diploma and you now want to move to a degree or for a degree in humanities you want to move over to science, you know. So for, for all that, we provide the online system, which we call our late inquiry system. Since we've opened this online inquiry system, um, you know, uh, uh, 55,000 or so have used it already, just from Monday. So you can see that it's working. And then if they can't access the system because of, say, internet access or anything like that, um, then uh, we have a call-in centre as well. That also, that also is open already from last week, but the, you know, the, the, the reason for the call centre is actually to assist with this late inquiry. So, just from Monday when it opened, we have already more than um, 30, 35,000 calls that we've received. For new first-time entry in first years, uh, we've received 130,000 plus, you know, mm. but close to 130,000. Um, and it's, it's, it's for only 10,000 places, so you can see the demand for places is very high. Mm -hmm.